you know, we're all getting outside a little bit more, hiking, playing golf, playing tennis, just doing anything out of doors, walking the Beltline. And that can put you at risk for bringing these home. Oh, man, that is the Lone Star Tick, a very common species of tick found here in our state. And it is the subject of some very important research right now that is going on at Emory University. The Lone Star Tick can carry the Heartland virus, a rare but deadly virus that was first discovered in 2009. It's killed one person in Georgia. It's tough to test for, and a whole lot is not known about it. And that is something that Emory researchers are hoping to change with their work this summer. We're going to start going outside that single location, visiting more than 20 state parks in the state, uh, looking for ticks and also testing them for infection. We're also looking for small mammals like rodents, try to see if we can find antibodies they have developed against the ticks because that might tell us a bit whether the small mammals are the ones circulating the virus among themselves. So armed with that information, researchers hope to create a map showing high risk areas. In the meantime, if you're heading outside, here's what symptoms to be on the alert for. You typically show up about two weeks after a tick bite and you watch for a fever, nausea or fatigue. And if you have reason to believe you have that virus, you wanna get in touch with your doctor so that they can run some tests.